Thank you so much, uh, Ram, for your exemplary, uh, pithy, and important work. And I note that you, we owe you seven minutes. I think you have extra credit for your uh, very pithy uh, presentation. Homo sapiens sapiens has become a geologic force. It is in this context that the youth remind us of climate change, unchecked climate change, sustainable consumption, and an ethic of care for and with the environment is so much at the center of the clamoring of youth the world over for the three fundamental pillars. If we listen carefully to the youth, as the Holy Father reminds us, we must do three lessons have become very, very clear. The environment, climate change, sustainable consumption is a point of entry into curiosity and the scientific method. Children and youth today, the world over, are clamoring for science at a time when our politicians are swimming in magical thinking and uh, 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 the antithesis of what a scientific orientation requires of all of us. Second, as Carola has reminded us, the quest of children and youth for climate change education is a point of entry into the ethics of what is unfolding before our very eyes. The work of uh, Professor Ramanathan and so many of our other colleagues in the Pontifical Academy of Sciences is perfectly clear on the following. The top billion people on Earth are responsible for producing the great pollution and the price of which today is being absorbed but the, by the bottom three billion people on Earth, folks that have nothing to do with creating the kinetic vectors that are presenting the existential challenge of our time. So again, climate change education is a point of entry into science and the scientific method and into curiosity, fundamental for all teaching and learning. Second, it is a point of entry into a reflection, into a conversation for the ethical issues that are at stake in the current kinetic momentum. Third, and uh, as important, it is a point of entry into youth agency, into mobilizing youth for their environment, for their future, for the future of our shared environment, our fragile environment, our planet moving forward. Thank you so much. We are in time, and we now have a period of discussion, so I invite